Imagine waking up one morning, pouring your coffee, and noticing something feels off. The morning light seems weaker, dimmer. You shrug it off. But across the world, scientists are panicking. Their telescopes all report the same impossible thing. The sun is shrinking. At first, it's just a curiosity. Sun loses a few kilometers in diameter. Hardly front page news. But then the reports turn alarming. The shrinkage is accelerating. The first thing people notice isn't the light, it's the cold. Autumn settles over the world and refuses to leave. Summers vanish, replaced by endless chill. Days grow shorter, sunlight turns pale and thin. Panic spreads. The sun, our life giver, is dying. And it's taking us with it. As the sun contracts, its gravity weakens. Earth's orbit begins to wobble. Seasons collapse. And yet humanity refuses to surrender. The greatest minds unite for a single mission. Project Helios's echo. The goal? Build artificial suns to keep civilization alive. Massive fusion reactors rise from frozen plains and deep underground bunkers. Cities are sealed inside domes to trap every ounce of warmth. Crops grow beneath violet lights. Outside, the world becomes a silent tundra of ice and twilight. Children are born who have never felt real sunlight, only the hum of the arc lights above. Elders tell stories of the before time, of blue skies and summer breezes. Those stories now sound like myths. If you'd miss the warmth of the real sun, hit like and subscribe for more impossible what-ifs. Years pass. Oceans freeze. The sun becomes a faint white disk, colder than the moon once was. Then, one by one, the artificial suns ignite. They glow with sterile brilliance, bathing domes in light, but not warmth of the soul. And here lies the twist. Humanity survives, but something inside us dies. We call it solar grief, the ache of living without a real sun. We conquered extinction, yet built ourselves a cage of light. A family stands beneath their artificial sun, its reflection glimmering in their eyes. Outside the dome, the frozen earth sleeps beneath a tiny fading star, the last heartbeat of our once magnificent sun. Would we survive the cold or lose ourselves trying? Tell me in the comments, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more videos.